People say, believe, I, why should I have faith in something? Because faith is believing without evidence. This, this is a very common trope in modern culture. Uh, you'll hear it from all the, what they call the new atheists, people like Sam Harris, who will literally say, you know, faith is belief without evidence. That has never been true for the Abrahamic tradition. Um, one of the most important uh, aspects of the Abrahamic traditions was to ground their faith in reason. And, and they gave very, you cannot study, you, if you take a survey course on religion, like the philosophy of religion, they'll do St. Thomas Aquinas, his five proofs for the existence of God. And they give them in very superficial, these truncated versions, reductive. Um, you have to spend a great deal of time to understand what Aquinas, and three out of the five he got from the Muslims. But you have to, you have to work very hard to understand why he came to those conclusions. The Summa is a summary of those. He has an entire metaphysical approach to those five proofs for the existence of God, which would used to take about 15 years before you could actually study those and really understand those proofs. Now they're taught in, in a philosophy course on religion as if, well, here it is. Here's their proofs for the existence of God. No, those aren't the proofs. Those are the conclusions of the proofs. Um, and, and the same is true for the Kalam cosmological argument that the Muslims embedded their um, worldview in. The Kalam cosmological argument takes a good deal of time to understand. It, it can't be understood uh, simplistically. 